where is this? So I am actually at the, ooh, hopefully I don't have this curb. I'm at the body shop picking up the Laguna Seca blue car because I now have to take a bunch of parts off of it before they can work on it. I'm actually gonna park over here. Um, uh, before they'll honor their original uh, price quote to me, which is a little silly, but uh, yeah, I think the battery is probably dead. So I brought my little jump pack. Oh, it's been a while since I've seen this car. Oh yeah, she's dead dead. <laughs> well, we'll see if my little lithium pack can start a dead vehicle. I know it's good for boosting, but uh, not sure if it needs some sort of voltage to begin with. Oh jeez. Oh, hey, lights are on. Let's give it a go. I heard beeps. Holy cow. <laughs> that little thing is impressive. Also, this car. Man, okay. Uh, first time I've used it, I bought it because I needed a new jump pack. Uh oh, is the alternator not working? spotted and the brakes are very rusty but it appears the alternator is working which is cool well I got the Laguna Seca safely back to the garage so I can work on that um, now I'm back down at my garage with the Tesla because I'm actually gonna paint these up to be uh, red like the performance cars leave these black just to try to be a little bit more uh, uh, correct but I just, I think they'll look better through these wheels. So I know my car isn't a performance car, whatever. Um, I was also noticing when I pulled the left rear off, I am cording pretty significantly. So yikes, I'll have to deal with that. Um, but yeah, the first step I think is gonna be uh, brake clean and wipe it down. Then I'm gonna prep the paint and uh, maybe mask off a few little things here just to make it easier for me to paint, specifically the bleeders. Uh, this brake line that goes across um, and then I've got some new black decals to go on top of the red calipers so hopefully this goes okay <laughs> um, it easily could not but I'm gonna give it a go okay just about done painting these things up just gonna let them dry and then uh, I've got some decals to put on them feels a little silly painting Brembo monoblocks but whatever things take absolutely forever to dry so I'm just gonna take the m5 home instead and get this thing tomorrow these don't look too bad nice and nice and glossy pretty smooth so just got to put the Tesla stickers on there and then I can get the wheels back on I gotta say these wheel nuts with these little beauty covers whatever you call these things they suck um, they start to loosen up over time and uh, I'm gonna maybe look into another set. Oh yeah, this is what happens. So it's like a 19 millimeter regular wheel nut in there. It's got these really terrible beauty covers on them. Anyway, gross, yes. <laughs> 